That's unfair. Whoa, look at all these audio gags and stuff here. What's this? Is this a mouse? Is this, is this a... What's going on here? This is not a mouse. This is not a mouse. Why is there a keyboard and mouse here? I guess all computers need one. Alright, the game starts. Game one. I don't know which Ice Climbers is which, but I'm pretty sure Captain Falcon is the mark. So we rootin' we rootin' for the Ice Climbers, you know. I like Frog, so I like Ice Climbers. Um Oh, we got a commentating homie. Oh, nope, nope, he's just chillin'. Never mind, just me watching this match again. So I like what Nino and uh Fujimine are doing so far. He's got a wobble going on one side. Ooh, but I don't know if that's really ideal when you have somebody like Peach. Um, ooh, sick, that happened. So I like what the Peach is doing. It's kind of like playing the support role, coming and breaking up any guaranteed kills and letting Mark F smash, which is like huge. Ooh, I thought, I thought there was going to be a down smash there. I guess it wasn't ideal. Ooh, my God. Tipper from Mark. That's crazy. So, this is my last tournament in Melee. It's kind of depressing for me. But, uh, gotta be honest, it's still pretty hype. Nice down smash, good spacing all around actually. We got a. Uh, not quite sure what Nino and Fujibine are actually going for. It just kind of seems like they're going for two one on ones. Which is probably a pretty good idea for us actually. Or he should have LP, you know. Uh, he could have made that. But, uh. Oh, that is an early SD, and then they're going to get the handoffs and the wobbles. Oh, wait, can they get a double wobble situation? Oh, that's what they're going to go for. They're going to go for the double wobbles. Yo, that's some cheese. How are you going to let them double wobbles? Oh, oh, never mind. They grabbed their own teammate. Oh, got one wobble going. Oh, the peach breaks it up. That's smart. Good up smash. Double wobble shenanigans going to be on another level, though. Down smash. Pretty hard comeback for Peach to make. Well, one's wobbling. Wait, add to the wobbles? Oh. Can you triple wobble? Can you have two wobbles? And one person? Is that a thing? Can you hand off to either IC? So. <laughs> well, the inevitable finally happened. So, I think what's important. Oh, wow, I look really cool. My jersey looking off for him. Uh, for the Marth, is to maintain center stage and let Peach kind of force the Icy's towards him into like F smashes and stuff, maybe. I don't, I don't know. But, uh,. This could work out. This could work out. If maybe they don't get double wobble together. Because that definitely happened. Ooh. That'll do it. Uh, I think it's a choice. I think like...
Damn. Marth and Peach are really getting messed up out here. It's kind of crazy. But the, they're doing pretty good with the center stage control this game. Uh, I do a pretty good job of keeping the climbers kind of separated, but it's hard with all these climbers to keep them all separated, you know. But <clears throat> the easier part is the fact that if you have Pete separating the climbers, you can just have Marth on one side, and Nana's just focused on getting to Popo and just have him just keep F smashing the Nana's. Super, super, oh no, oh no, oh no, what are they Oh, okay. I was about to say, what are these shenanigans? What is this? What is this? This is not what we want. This is not what the people want. Double wobbles. This is this kind of savagery can only be found from Nino and and uh, Fujimine. No, Brog wouldn't have done this. Brog's equivalent to both of these guys fused together. That's the thing. Brog is like the Goku of ice climbers. And Nino is like the Goten, and Fuji Bean's like the Trunks, you know? Like, Fuji Bean's not his son, but he tries to be like, like Goku. Like, he'll do a Kamehameha in the movie and stuff, you know? We all, we all seen that. We know the fraudulence was real. Is this, is this Sickle, Sickle Poe about the, huh, I was about to say, uh, oh, looking like some shenanigans right there. That could have been, that could have been great. Um, oh, nice there. Nice there. That might have won them the game right now. Oh no! Oh, oh, never mind. No, I thought I, <laughs> I slammed this video way more than that, but clearly not. No, yeah. So they tie it up, 1-1. One, one. Take it to Battlefield. Zant's uh, actually a really good speech. I teamed with them before. Um, as a Marth. He was really good at giving me support, so. Maybe Captain Falchion was the Marth he needed. That's a pretty good pick. Uh -huh. I think Marth actually does really well against Icy's on this stage, and so does Peach. But in double, it's different because Marth can't use all the space. And I guess, but I feel like this is still a pretty good pick for Marth and Peach. They can separate the timbers far enough. I don't know. This is an interesting pick for sure. Uh, we could do. I wish there was another personality to talk to. But just me and I don't want to look crazy talking to myself and myself like that, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I know what you mean. Uh, well, you know what I mean? Like, sometimes it kind of goes crazy. Yeah, I agree. Sometimes like the talking to yourself stuff should be kind of crazy sounding, but like, you're not crazy, bro. So, so what do you think about this map? Uh, I think that, uh, you know, like, Marth, Peach are a really good team. I've never really seen a double ICs team, you know? You they're not doing things you'd expect from double IC, he's just, just double wobbling and stuff. <laughs> like, well, I feel like that's also probably not as easy to get as it seems, like, especially when you're going up against Marth and Peach, who are really good at just constantly hitting away my climbers and keeping them over the distance and stuff. Ooh, that was a crazy good read by Sand. Great read. Um, I'm assuming Fuji Bean is J and straight is Nino, uh, straight is Nino, so I don't know if they're from J Street or something like that. They might be, you know, you never know where they're from. Everybody in this factory from somewhere. Oh, shut up. Just, just shut up, dude. What, what, what? Why would you say this? I don't know, I just have to explain things. Yeah, yeah, that's why, that's why we don't let you talk now. Um, anyway. Yeah, sorry about that, that was not weird. Um, 
It's, it's hard, man. Solo commentary is weird. No one, no one to talk to to make jokes with. Just kind of get the, get the row hit. Say myself, I'm like kind of a really boring person. I'm really good at bouncing off other people's ideas. I'm really good at making my own. Maybe that's why I'm quitting melee. I feel like everything I do, just like everybody else, you know. I really like. Uh, when I first joined it, I was like, I'm gonna create my own mark style, and then it's gonna w I'm gonna win my way. I'm starting to realize like everything I do is just not good, and like the more I do less of myself, the better I get. So it's not even worth. Like, what's the point? Oh, oh, look at this. Bros, oh my god, here comes the Stango face. This is hype. This is like, oh, oh, the double wobbles are out in full force. Yep, and that's, that's, that's a way to end teams. Well, on that note, I'm out.